Hey there, YouTube. It's Math Baller. Welcome to my Mainline Autograph Show preview video. Now, I'm making this video a little bit earlier than what I'd like, but that's okay. This coming weekend, we're talking Friday, Saturday, Sunday, May 20th, 22nd, and 20, 20th, 21st, and 22nd is the Mainline Autograph Show. And that'll be held at the Monroeville Convention Center. So, you know, there's some cool stuff. There's free autographs for the first paid 225 admissions on Friday and Saturday. Door prizes, free parking. There's the ticket information and the show hours again. So, let me show you my game plan here. Now, I did buy the VIP package. I did buy that. General admission, $10 per day. VIP package. Limited to 100, apparently they're sold out. Three days admission, 30 minute early admission Saturday and Sunday. $100 of autograph tickets randomly picked by mainline autographs. These tickets are not are non refundable and cannot be exchanged. Five autographed 8x10 photos from athletes from our previous shows, $100 value, and front of the line access to autograph gifts. Per really, really, really good perks there. So I'm going to go ahead and show you my initial game plan. And. This will be my Wednesday video, so I won't have my mainline autograph show videos ready, but on Saturday, my Saturday upload will be my third and final video from that nice card show that I went to in Monroeville. So, my first stack here has two photos. These are going to JSA. JSA will be on site. Barry Bonds and Bobby Bonilla. Now, there's going to be more. I want to get $100 worth of authentications. There's another Barry Bonds, Bobby Bonilla. And there's a real good-looking guy in the middle there, Andy Van Slyke. So, uh, wow, that would look really nice. Triple signed. Hmm. But so far, those are the two things that are going to go to the mainline show. I got some cards here I'm going to give to my buddy Ed if I can make it on Sunday. These are all players who signed TTM, so I'm going to hook him up with some cards. So that's if I can make it on Sunday. Sunday's up in the air. I do plan to buy packs of cards from the autograph card. They'll be there. But that's JSA. That's for a friend. Now this is for the signers. On Friday, they have two free signers, four former Pirate pitchers, Mark Wilkins and Chris Peters. I will most likely buy a photo for about 6 bucks or whatever off of them and get them to sign up. But just in case if I change my mind, I'm taking a baseball for them. Then my biggest favorite one. Uh, last show... I had 10 things signed by Steve Blass. Well, I have 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8 things to get signed by Kent Colvey. Teak, Kent Colvey. I enjoy listening to him so much. Uh, I have two different bobbleheads for him. I have his ticket to his 1,000th game. He pitched in 1,050 games. That's his ticket from the stuff. That's a ticket from his 1,000th game. Here's a baseball. Just a plain baseball. I'd like to get him to sign Rubber Band Man. There is a baseball that I already got personally signed by Tommy Lasorda back in the 2016 uh, convention. Yeah, yeah. I think it was 2016 when it was in Atlantic City. There's an inscription that goes along with that. There's a Pink Laces baseball. That'll be with the K Cancer inscription. There's a commemorative 1979 ball from back in... 2019. This was game issued, not game used. I'll get that with a nice inscription, as I will this 1979 World Series ball. He had the Game 7 save, so I might even add another one of these, because he pitched nine consecutive days. And I've already got one signed with that inscription, but that is such an amazing feat. Why not get another? So that's Friday. Saturday, the signer, well, here's the signers I'm going for. We got Bill Mazeroski. We got Bill Mazeroski. That would look so nice with that ink on there. And that's Elroy Face in the middle there. And I know I could get it a little bit cheaper, but I have this baseball. It's a bit beat up. I bought this baseball at the mainline show. A guy had a dollar bin. It was buried in it. That's an old Spalding baseball. I want to get signed by somebody. So, 
Who better than Bill Mazeroski on the sweet spot with 10-13-60 inscription. That's the date of his Game 7 walk-off home run to end the World Series Game 7 walk-off. So we got that. John Candelaria is going to be there. Got this Pepsi disc still attached. And then I got a ticket sub from his first win against the Mets. That's a cool ticket. Mets rule. I bet you love that rain check logo there. We got Mr. Met with the umbrella all bummed out because of the rain. Andy Van Slyke was going to be there. I got a bobblehead for him. I also got this photo. I'm hoping they have some better quality ones of this shot because I think that's hilarious. And this program. That would look nice with uh, his signature. Nice and bold there. And not if, but when, <laughs> optimistically, that gets passed by JSA. Bam! Oh my goodness, that would look amazing. Also going to be there Saturday is Elroy Face coming back. Oh, and I have a second one of those. Elroy Face can sign both of them. Elroy Face will be a singleton on that one. And then we'll get Elroy Face and Bill Mazeroski on that one. And also on Saturday will be Rick Rushel, who has been very present at Pirates alumni events, but not recently for obvious health reasons. So we'll give him the sign the Sports Illustrated with the inscription Big Daddy. And then Sunday. I'm not sure if I'll be able to make it Sunday. Uh, lots of going on in Matt Fuller's family life here. And I uh, don't know if I can make it on Saturday. Or uh, on Sunday. But Sam McDowell's going to be there all three days signing his book. So I kind of put this toward the back. But I would like to get his autograph with the six-time All-Star and five-time strikeout leader inscriptions. Hugh Green's going to be there. And this would really pop with some gold ink right there. Or even a silver ink. So there he is on the cover of a Sports Illustrated. And also Chad Brown. I don't have... I would, mind, I would not mind adding him to my mini helmet collection with the three-time Pro Bowl inscription. But these last two may not happen. But in any case, folks, there's my initial game plan as far as the signers are concerned. As far as, well, JSA, but that's not completed yet. But um, I'm going to add more to that pile. Plus, I have a pretty nice little budget on buying stuff. So... This will be my preview video for the main line autographs. I'm willing to bet I'll have at least three videos showing what I got at this awesome regional show. So, hey, if you happen to see me there, that's great. Um, I'm not taking a Three Rivers Stadium seat back, which was actually pretty nice for people to identify me. But I couldn't even tell you what shirt I'm going to be wearing there. I'll, I'll probably be a pirate shirt or just something generic. But, hey, in any case, let me know. If you plan to go to the show, and I'll upload some videos for you. I do three videos a week, a TTM video on Monday, and an autograph and or trading card video on Wednesdays and Saturdays. I would appreciate it if you would like, comment, subscribe to my channel, and I can't wait for Kent to call me to sign all those awesome things. Take care, everybody.